Hi, my name is Bob Zolo and I'm an engineer with Agilent Technologies. Today I'd like to share with you an exciting new product which we call the Advanced Power System, which is designed to solve your toughest test challenges. Today what I'd like to show you is how this new series of products, which include one and two kilowatt models, can be used to solve the test challenge of properly powering your device on and off. So let me explain the test setup that we have here today. The top instrument is one of the new Advanced Power System power supplies. This is a two kilowatt model. Underneath is one of our uh, N6700 modular power systems, which is a multiple output, low power power supply. And what we're going to be doing as simulating a device under test is using these uh, LED tail lights from a car. So we're going to turn them on in a particular sequence. Now sequencing uh, multiple outputs of power supplies on and off in the correct order is important for many different applications, including PC motherboard test or satellite payload test, or anything where the device under test requires multiple power supplies. Now the way I've got it configured right now is by pressing the single on button, it will not only turn on the main power supply, but send a signal to the second power supply and turn it on in the correct order as well. So we're going to be sequencing one, two, three, and there'll be one second of time in between, and then I'll hit the off button, and they'll sequence off in the opposite direction with one second in between. So let me show you. We'll hit the on button, one, two, three, and then we'll hit the off button, one, two, three. So all this was done without the involvement of a PC. It was just due to the built-in timing of the advanced power system and the, its, its companion product, the modular power system, for lower power applications. Now, in the past, how would you have done this? Well, probably the only way to do it would be to hook it up to a computer and have used a computer to sequence the outputs on and off in the correct order with the correct timing. The problem with using a computer for this, though, is that the computer's timing is not very regular. Uh, the operating system is not guaranteed as far as its performance is concerned. Whereas the timing built into the power, the advanced power system is regulated with hardware uh, precision. It is small increments as one millisecond and as large as several seconds. So you can control the on order very precisely and very repeatedly, which you can't get controlling from a computer. You can also control the slew rate as the power supplies turn on and off. So that's the advanced power system. It's meant to solve your toughest power challenges, including powering your device on and off correctly. For more information on the advanced power system, please see the URLs that are listed on your screen right now. Thank you.